Let nobody disencourage you. Encourage yourself. Okay? Sometimes you have to encourage yourself. sorry about that so like i was saying we're back with another video and this is going to be the start to my moving vlog i'm so excited and i'm just super excited ah! i just i cannot believe that this is happening i had just stopped to get me something to eat let me wind my windows up because it's a little windy so i just stopped to get me something to eat and as y'all can see we have some totes well, we just have one back there that's filled with clothes. So I figured, you know, obviously like I'm moving, I have so much clothes that I just don't wear. And I'm just like, you know what? Let me just finally like act on it and give these clothes away. Um, so that's what we're doing today. I'm going, I'm actually heading to Plato's Closet right now. And we are about to get these clothes sorted because majority of these clothes y'all like I have not worn or I've only worn one time. So I'm like, I might as well get at least some money for it. And then whatever they don't take, I'll just donate to Goodwill or um, the Salvation Army. So that's what we doing. I just need to get rid of all of the clothes that I'm not wearing and whatever I'm bringing with me, you know, is the clothes that I'm obviously wearing. So yeah, that's what we doing. We about to drop these clothes off. Um, so yeah, today's a good day. We're gonna get it started. Um, and actually today is also the, what what is today's date? I think it's the 16th or 17th. Um, and my moving date is June 1st. So by the time y'all see this, it'll probably be June 1st or like June 2nd or something. I don't know. But yeah, my moving date is June 1st and we are starting two weeks early because we need to get everything that we need to get and we need to just have everything organized. So I'm gonna be packing and just vlogging and showing y'all like my process of moving. And we're gonna turn this into a series because obviously we have the packing part. Like we obviously have to also, um, we gotta organize. Like once we get there, I, ju I just have so much content in my mind and I just cannot wait. So let's just get to it y'all, let's get to it. So I'll just see y'all at Plato's Closet. All right, y'all, so I just dropped the clothes off at Plato's, but I'm in TJ Maxx right now. And I'm seeing all of this stuff, what was way more on Amazon. So I grabbed a cart. Yeah, they have so much stuff in here. It's been a while since I've been in a Target. And not a Target, a TJ Maxx. I'm so happy I came in here. They have so much stuff. Wow. They have different... Ooh, child. Y'all, for the amount of stuff I got, no way. It was all so affordable. I'm so happy I stopped in there. I forgot how um how cheap TJ Maxx is. But y'all got all of this stuff for $100. So we're about to head into Play-Dohs because they said my order was ready. y'all so i just went to go pick the clothes up and guess how much money they gave me for the clothes just take a guess 36 dollars. <laughs> 
I don't get it though because literally like majority of the pieces in there I'm, I'm telling you they still have tags on it so i'm confused but anyways i am in the um the plaza still because i'm about to run into dollar tree and just pick up like the little nitty gritty stuff that i would need um like toothpaste and toothbrushes and stuff like that um just while i'm here because why not and then after i leave here um, I did want to go into Home Goods just to see what they have. I've never been in Home Goods before, so I kind of just wanted to, like, you know. But, oh, yeah, I kind of wanted to just go in Home Goods and just see what they had because I've never been in there before. But um, I don't know if I'm going to do that. I might, depending on how I feel. I might just be too tired or drained or whatever. I'm grateful for my $36. It's going to go towards Family Dollar and all my necessities now because, you know, we got to improvise. We got bills now so we have to be you know yeah so let's head into family dollar and y'all it is so hot my lace is like trying its hardest not to come up right now but whatever oh and i also filmed a video this morning hence the makeup i'm on my grind you know i've been working i'll be on my zoom every morning at 10 a.m yeah <laughs> anyways let's go i'm a mess all right, let's go see what we can pick up. So we switched to my camera, of course. I'm in my second bedroom right now. And I'm about to empty out. Y'all, this looks a hot mess. Oh my gosh. I'm just about to clear out all of this. So this was my old makeup station and everything in here I have not touched for years. So we have to get this together ASAP. So I'm just going to clean out the drawers and yeah, just start clearing some stuff out because I just have too much stuff and that's a part of the problem. And I just want to try to at least get as much done as possible and also i got this storage drawer set from ignore all of that that is all my jackets and stuff that i need to put on new hangers and just like rearrange everything but we just need to get this together because this is so old y'all this stand is like five years old like all of this stuff. oh my god let me show you guys all of this trash i don't use any of this stuff so oh my gosh this is my urban decay foundation like i'm pretty sure a majority of this stuff is expired let me check my chest my breath right quick he ain't never seen it in a dress like this Girl, you make me go so loco, loco, make me go crazy. We would make a beautiful baby. Knock on wood, is you trying to baby? me? Wow. Is this my Fenty? Gosh, my NYX? My Anastasia? No way, no way, no way. Wow. Also, today is Sunday. Um, I actually just came back from the movies and right now we're gonna start packing up some stuff so i am doing a good job with like boxes and stuff i haven't had to pay any boxes because my mom um she got some boxes for me like the amazon boxes so i'm just gonna reuse those um i got some packaging tape so first i definitely want to package all of my kitchen stuff in one box and I have so much kitchen stuff, y'all. Like, my kitchen is pretty much everything that I need for my kitchen is. I got it. But, um, I just ordered my bed frame today. So, it should get to me, I think, two days before I move in. Yeah, I got my couch. I got my mattress. I need to get my TV for the living room. So, I'll probably do that this week. And... I think just for like starting off like moving in somewhere I think I got everything that I need so right now I'm gonna get all of my kitchen stuff and bring it into my room so that I can just easily pick the stuff up so 
that's what we about to do i got majority of my kitchen stuff from tj maxx and amazon y'all pretty much everything in my apartment gonna be from amazon because who got time to deal with all of these other websites not me but we just about to speed all of this up so let's just get to it Alright y'all, so we pretty much, we packed up about five, six boxes. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So majority of this stuff is all kitchen stuff. Y'all, I told y'all I had all of my kitchen stuff already ready. I got bought it on because I took my wig off. It was getting too hot. But... We got seven boxes packed. I feel like what I'm about to do now is at least try to empty out that closet over there. Um, because it's all winter clothes. I'm not going to wear that no time soon. So I might as well just start packing it up. And I think I'm just going to put it in um, another box. be easier to like unpack if I do it that way. And the stuff on the hanger, I'm just going to collect all of those stuff in plastic trash bags i'm gonna show you how i'm gonna do that but i'm waiting for my hangers to come and they come tomorrow so i'm gonna take off all my clothes put them on a new hanger and then you know put them all together so everything could just be easier but yeah we about to bring all this stuff down well i'm not but <laughs> or i could just lay down you know why are you laying down because oh. i need your help why are you laying down? I'm tired. No, you're not. Come on, we got. Well, I'm you got. Tired, stuff. Grandpa. You have to bring these boxes down. So let's get to it. I'm about to start with my clothes over there, so I'm gonna set up another box and then just start taking the clothes out of that closet. I I feel like this is gonna be the most stressful part. Like, oh my gosh, and I have like four bins of clothes so I definitely feel like that's what's going to stress me out but it's okay we're going to get it done we have one more week one more week and then I'm out of here oh my gosh bittersweet but I'm excited I'm excited can't believe it the time has come for my dreams to be heard, they will not be put aside or thrown into your own. All cause you won't listen. You wanted to open up Who your you mouth to me to? first. Why are you looking at me like you don't have stuff to do? I don't. What do I gotta do? Bring those boxes in. I don't even know how to tape a box to you. Oh my god. Here goes oh the OCD god. police. Yo. Here goes the OCD police. Get out of here. I'm going to take the boxes down. You got your camera set on the box. Because <laughs> this box is behind you. Start with those. You is. Talk about this shit on label got to be on the top like you shipping a box off somewhere. I'm not. So, okay. So, what are you saying? So, <laughs> so what are you saying? So, if you saying that... It doesn't matter what's top or bottom. What was the point of you trying to tell me that it was upside down? Dang. I hate people like you. What if I fall? Be careful. 
Oh, you care about me? No. She's the oldest. The oldest. Tell me you care about me. I care about you so much. You can't throw out the dirt. Wow, I forgot I had all these sets. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to just take out my clothes that I'm going to wear for the 10 days. And just have them ready for my suitcase. Um, so that I don't have to worry about unpacking as soon as I get there. So, if y'all see me putting stuff to the side, that's what I'm doing. But the good thing is that I was pretty organized when I was um, doing this closet. I did everything by section. So, like, my top shelf is all color coordinated sets and then the bottom shelf are just single pieces like sweatpants or hoodies or sweatshirts. You really leaving me? Okay. clothes right here are clothes that need to get put on um the skirt hanger with the clips let me show you what i'm talking about um these hangers like that i could just hang my skirts and like my strapless tops on so literally all of this clothes are my winter clothes um i guess like this like my little jackets they're gonna be put in different spaces but majority of this stuff is like all long sleeve like yeah so we will not be needing this for like another five months so i'm gonna separate these clothes into a different bag um because they're gonna be going into my second closet summer clothes as y'all can see i separated them and also they are color coordinated so we got the black we got the cream the browns tans turned olive olive greens and then more greens pink purple blue jean and orange and that's where we stopped at all of these up here are jeans i need to go through those but i have to order more hangers and i'm gonna get jean hangers for my jeans like my pants and stuff and also the skirt hangers for my strapless tops this whole bag y'all is a bag filled with clothes that was in my closet that i'm just like yeah no i don't want this anymore um all of that is like my old hangers just very not organized like not the same type of vibe so these are the hangers that i got from amazon they're white velvet hangers um i kind of want a white and gold but i think the white and silver is kind of super neutral so I just want everything to be organized. <laughs> I have to order more hangers tonight and yeah, we're gonna get all of these hangers situated into like a random box or bag or whatever. Drawers are gonna be the most stressful parts. Like my drawer was completely white and this, I did this like four years ago y'all. I painted my dresser black and I did like three coats of it. Obviously the paint is chipping so it just looks horrid and a mess. On top of my dresser, I have so many perfumes, lotions, facial stuff, jewelry. Uh, it's just too much. So this whole area right here is what I'm dreading. Like, I'm very nervous to get to this part. But, yeah, I guess I'll see y'all tomorrow. Hey, guys. So, yeah, your girl done got all dolled up. But I ain't going nowhere. I just did, like, a quick, I promise y'all, is literally this took me, the makeup took me, like, 10 minutes tops so if y'all want like an updated really quick you know early morning makeup tutorial then let me know and if y'all want to see how i installed this wig then check the description box down below i have i'll have the link to this video it was already posted way before this one so go check it out if you haven't but it's been forever since i had color in oh my god i feel so different but i feel so cute I did my eyebrows a little burgundy color too. Even though this is like ginger, but I'm loving it. This looks bomb, okay? But before we even get started with 
the whole packing. Let me fill y'all in on the chaos that has been that has just been happening and I don't know everything I don't want to say everything has been going wrong because I'd be lying if I said that God is he keeps working so um earlier this week I became a citizen I'll insert a little video right here so that y'all can see but yes I, I became a citizen um on Tuesday Today is currently Thursday, um, and it's late. It's at like 9.51. My mom is like a gem. She decided to order my bed frame for me, the one that I wanted, and it FedEx delivered it to the wrong house. <sighs> so y'all can understand my frustration. And the way that these delivery drivers just be doing their job, they don't be caring. So it was a whole thing with FedEx with Amazon trying to figure out where my package is y'all I was stressed I just had got off the phone with them and I finished a client today and on top of all of that while I was done somebody is knocking on my door and I'm like who's that I don't have another client turns out the address that they dropped my package to the person came to my address and was like hey we have your package like I was like, girl, say less. I'm coming. I'll come get it right now. So we walked over there. It was literally like a few houses down. And they actually helped me bring it to my house. Like, it was that heavy. I feel like four people should have been carrying it, but it was just three. And I'm just like, yo, God works because I was stressed. I'm like, I need my bed frame. Like, I need my stuff. Okay, I move in seven days. I need my things. We got to get it together. My bathroom isn't even packed up yet. So I feel like I'm going to do my bathroom last because obviously like I have to shower and stuff. So this will probably be the last thing that I pack up. But yeah, I got my bed frame. But now my couch people, they are stressing me out. We ain't even going to talk about it. We just going to pray and hope that God, God going God, right? Okay. <laughs> so that's that was a little like catch up. For y'all because it's just been a lot of stuff going on left and right and like my plates and stuff in the kitchen and then yeah i'll probably end up just chilling for the rest of the night um i have work tomorrow with clients so i don't want to exhaust myself too much so yeah that's what we'll probably end up doing Let's just get to packing, y'all. Let's get to packing. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so let's just get to it. I'm keeping this on until I go to bed because I feel cute. Yeah, because everyone else already gives their input and tell me, you know, oh, I would never, oh, I would never. So I just. Oh, that's too much. Oh, that's a, yeah. Yo, just a bunch of dream crushers. Yeah. She said, let me tell you, baby girl, I got you. I'm the most important person that you need to got you. Is your mom and God. And when I tell you God got you, he will not leave you this far and leave you alone. Don't listen to nobody. That's the one thing I can tell you. Nobody can walk in the shoes that God called you to walk in. Nobody can walk in the bed that God called you as she could to sleep in. So let me tell you, girl, hold your head up high. And God, for what He's about to do in your life, because He got you 100%. You don't need to worry about nothing. Just hold your head up, give God thanks, and just walk with it, because He's going to lead you all the way through. All right, baby girl? You got this. 100%. You got this. I got this. You got this. God got you. That's all you need. Bye, God.
Hey guys, so it is Saturday, May 27th at 3.30. But I want to show you guys, I got some packages um, this morning. I actually, hold on. I actually just came from, ooh, that was disrespectful. I just came from church, but earlier this morning I got some packages. So I ordered another set of hangers, the velvet hangers. This is a hundred pack. And then my trash can came today. But I feel like it's so small. But this is considered a tall 13 gallon trash can. So I don't know. So I just wanted to show y'all this. I'm actually about to eat and go get my nails done. Um, I'm doing a maintenance vlog because I want to get all dolled up for my moving date because I'm that extra. So I'm about to go get my nails done in like an hour. And yeah, y'all, my nails are going to look so cute. I held out with getting my nails done because, you know, you're going to have to save. Like, I was trying to be smart with my money. So I couldn't get my nails done. For like three weeks and i'm dying because what are these and it's also memorial day weekend so we're not too sure what we're doing this weekend we might turn up a little bit but yeah but y'all probably just see my nails afterwards because like i said i'm doing a maintenance vlog so. uh, good afternoon it is tuesday the 30th and we officially have two more days left like that's insane so hold on one second because this this battery is about to die, so let me change it. This one? Yeah. Oh, it is bright. It's well, bright compared to that one. Uh, yeah, that was TCL. That's actually the wrong tag up there. Thank you. You're welcome. You guys have a good one. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all, so the car is all packed. Oh, packed. This is my mom's car, y'all. She is crazy. The car is packed. Oh my gosh. Yes. Let's go. <laughs> it's not even like it's falling. Y'all, the car is all packed. Oh my gosh. Are you ready? <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. All right, y'all. So, excuse my AC, y'all. It's on, on. Oh my God, and I don't have my seatbelt on. But I'm just going down the street to the gas station. Literally, I'm right here. Um, so, let's get this party started. Oh, my bag. Where's my bag? Oh, crap. Okay, hold on. Oh. She don't know how to pump gas. <laughs> Let me put in my home address. Okay. Welcome. Welcome to my humble oasis. Okay. <laughs> so first you come in um, and you have like this little entryway right here. I think I'll probably put like a table and like a mirror just to open it up a little bit. And then come this way. <laughs> and then you don't have to be perfect. You know, I'm going to go through it and like crop up. So I know. Okay. Stop talking. Do what you're doing. Okay, so over here we come this way and we have our fridge. It's double. Oh, pulling the wrong Show thing. me off and bring it up. Like close up. You move up. I okay. don't want to move up. I want to do. Okay, so this top finger, this top button. Mm hmm. We'll bring it in. 
Okay. And then the bottom button brings it out. Okay. Over here we have our fridge. Okay, okay. We have our freezer, ice maker. Um, yeah. And then over here we have our cabinets. Cabinets. Oh, I can put in here. Um, cabinets. And then we have our microwave, basic microwave. Then, come on, come on, come on, girl. So here we have our sink, not our sink, our <laughs> stove. Are you showing me? Yes. I'm in it? Yes. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. Oh my God, so then... <laughs> Stop, she can't got you. You know I'm good at this. Okay, okay. So now we have our stove. It is electric electric stove and um yeah never had an, an electric we had gas okay but this oven it's a brand new y'all everything to you okay oh lord this is gonna take us forever with my mother don't do it like that just keep going <laughs> okay y'all it's an air fryer um yeah and then we have more storage space of course now, over here is a dishwasher also something We've never had. And here is our deep sink. Come take a look. Come take a look. And of course, look at this. Ooh, ah. Take it off. Ooh. Say, I want to turn it on. Ah. Okay. And beautiful, beautiful island. There's my large window. Um, beautiful, beautiful light fixtures. A really long island. I have one window right here. Is my living. And we have the mount already on because we just like that, okay? And we got our beautiful fireplace. I can't wait till the- That changes lens, color. That changes color. Yes. It actually produces heat. And let's not forget, this is all surround sound. And y'all, my, my favorite- Wait, no. My favorite part. She's so excited. She's so excited. <laughs> my favorite part of this entire apartment I have speakers in the room. Yeah. You come down here and here is the hallway and straight to the left is our first bedroom. And yes, I said first, okay. So we have our beautiful two windows right here. It's really, it's pretty big, pretty big space. And in this room, the closet is much bigger than the master. I don't know why they did that, but um much bigger and they are custom closets so we have this side and let me show y'all the other side we have the lighting is so good in here yeah and then we have this side i'm thinking all of my winter clothes are going to be in here and all of like my clothes that i wear on an everyday basis is going to be in that room and then for the shelves um I think I'm gonna just put like my bags and my perfumes and stuff on those. I'm excited. So this is gonna be my beauty room, of course. And we're gonna we're gonna make this our colorful room. So it's gonna be colorful. And like just wait, just wait for the decor videos, y'all. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> so now we have our washer and our dryer. Hey, I didn't see you there. <laughs> um, so yeah, we have our washer and our dryer and then back here is like all of the techie stuff. And then we come to our first bathroom and well, here is our first bathroom. And y'all, this is also one of my favorite things about the apartment, the shower. Like, Are you kidding? I can't even touch. <laughs> this bathroom literally has one, two, it has two jets, uh, one that you can take off and one from the top. Rain down on me, let your love fall like raindrops. You wanna come here? Come, come. Ooh, we can fit. 
We can fit. Oh my gosh. Okay. So let's head to the mask shop. So first of all, let me close this door real quick. Right? Here's my bedroom. We open. And oh, it feels so cool in here. Here is my bedroom. Exact same layout as the second bedroom. But let me show y'all the closet. So this is what I was saying. This closet is much smaller. But it's okay because I didn't want to have a lot of stuff in my bedroom. I kind of wanted my bedroom just to be like really simple. And my, my whole like design for this room is going to be very neutral, beige, very calm, minimalist type of vibe that y'all are so tired of, but I love. So here we have, I think I'm just going to hang everything up, up there. And y'all saw my velvet hangers. It's going to look so nice up here. So we have another cubby and then like a small area right there. Um, yeah, y'all. And then we're gonna go to my bathroom. Hey, here is my bathroom. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. So here's my bathroom. Oh, and these open up, but I'm gonna be real with y'all. I actually hate this color inside, so I'm definitely gonna be putting some type of wallpaper in here to like brighten it up a bit. So that's definitely gonna be something on the to-do list. But we have a medicine cabinet for like storage, make up here look a little cute. We have down here, um, it's pretty open. I did wish that I had drawers, but it's okay. So of course, Oh, Lord. <laughs> and our shower is the exact same. We we'll talk about the shape of the toilet. Just oh, yeah. About, the shape is giving. Look at the shape, people. It's giving somebody it. used my toilet. No, they did not. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, this apartment complex. Talk about this. Oh, yeah. So every room has a remote. The remote controls the fan. fan. Yeah, that's it. The remote controls the fan. That's it? I that's thought it. it was for the AC and stuff. Um, I'm actually not I'm sure, but I'm, gonna read. I'm not going to read. But y'all, that is it! It's so sad. happy! Y'all, uh, my mama is really the GOAT. So we actually are about to deep clean the apartment. We about to get everything together. We about to bring everything up, whatever we can. But he won't be here until later. So we're gonna do as much as we can. I love this apartment. <laughs> you could do for yourself, girl, this is the best thing you could do for yourself. Let nobody distract you. Let nobody disencourage you. Encourage yourself, okay? Sometimes you have to encourage yourself, okay? Because guess what? What God has for you is no for man. You. No That's man right. can take it away. That's right. Uh -huh. What's for you, girl? It's it is for you. Yeah. You. Yep. Okay. Yeah. You gotta open the door, you just walk, walk in. right in. Yep. Can't wait to decorate because the decorating videos are coming. Oh my gosh, the decor is gonna be so cute, y'all. My furniture is gonna get here in a few weeks. Um, I have some other stuff coming too, so I can't wait. I can't wait. I'm excited. Um, but yeah, let's get to packing. So I thank y'all so much for tuning in to today's video. If y'all are excited for me, then tell me congratulations in the comments. Don't be rude. Say congr congratulations and also subscribe. If you haven't, you're going to want to because the content is about to be on fire. Okay? And if you haven't, go and watch my Get Ready With Me on TikTok because the girlies be eating that up. Okay? So, thank y'all so much for tuning in to today's video. And we'll see y'all in the next one. Bye!
Thank y'all so much for y'all support. Love I love you. Love you. Stay blessed. Stay blessed. Always. Y'all, I look crazy. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. Guys. I am, I know, I know, corny, right? To be recording yourself while you're crying or whatever. But y'all, I just felt God's spirit so much just now. I have no, no choice. But to break out in praise and just thank God for everything, y'all. I'm so grateful. I am just so excited for this new journey in my life. I'm overwhelmed. I'm overwhelmed. I'm listening to Big by Pastor Mike Jr. And y'all, me just singing those words, me repeating those words, it brought me to tears. I am so grateful. I'm so thankful. We have nothing to do in this life but to trust God that's it and it's so hard it's so hard to do when you cannot see but that's the beauty of it all we cannot see so to know to know that all we do is pray and bring God every single one of our concerns every one of our worries and he continuously time after time again just comes through is amazing I just I cannot I broke out in tears I'm just so happy. I don't know where this video is going to come into my vlog. But this I literally ended my vlog last night. I'm putting this in there. Absolutely. People need to know how good God it. Y'all, I feel so blessed. I'm so thankful. I appreciate y'all support. I'm just so excited and ready for this new journey in my life. It can only get better. I'm not going to worry. I'm not going to stress. I'm going to trust God in everything that I do. And that's it that's it that's all i had to say i'm gonna go back to um praising god right now mm, mm, y'all god is so good he is so good i'm so grateful i'm so thankful thank you jesus because it's gonna be big thank you jesus thank you thank y'all for watching okay i'm done i'm done being emotional well to y'all i'm gonna get back to my praise because i have a lot to be thankful for okay all right <laughs>